Good day folks and welcome back to another video slots review from About Slots. Sorry that it's been a while since the last review but I have been moving so we've had to order some new recording equipment and so on. But we are now back stronger than ever and we can already spoil that probably sometime in next week we will have a full video review out on Slot Tumble, our own slot in collaboration with Relax Gaming, so be on the lookout for that. But without further ado, we're gonna take a look at a new game from Elk Studios, a new game in the Gold series called Dead Man's Gold. Let's dig in. The game has a starting grid of 6 reels and 4 rows, but just like in the other gold games, this will expand upwards every time you make a winning combination, up to a maximum of 8 rows. Once again, we do feel obligated to voice some complaints about the RTP of 94%, as Elk has such high standards when it comes to everything else, but 94% RTP is well below par. On a more brighter note, you can expect some high volatility action and a potential max win of 25,000 times the bet. The easiest and most concise way to go over the features here is simply to take a look at the Exciter features as all of those, except the Super Bonus, can also land and be triggered during base game, so keep that in mind. The first Exciter buy is sort of the core feature of any recent gold game at least, it's the big blocks. This can be bought at a cost of 5 times the bet, guaranteeing that at least one 2x2, 3x3 or 4x4 big symbol will land on the grid. The second one is a new mechanic called the bottomless chest. We have however seen something similar to this in Catlin Gold. So when a bottomless chest lands and space opens up in the row above it, so if you make a connection including a symbol on that reel, the chest will open up and push out higher paying symbols, wild symbols and cannon balls above it. As we said, the chest can also land in base game, but if you want to buy it straight away, that comes at a cost of 10 times the bet. Before we talk about the third Exciter buy, we should go over the fire, the cannon and treasure targets mechanics. Cannonballs can land on the reels, and they will be loaded into a cannon. If you then land a treasure target, the cannon will fire at it, revealing wild symbols behind it and blowing up non-paying symbols around it. There are also multiplier treasure targets, and you can see those since they have a golden X on them. And about that third feature, it can be bought at a cost of 25 times the bet and gives the cannon unlimited ammo for the next spin, so any treasure target that lands will be shot. And lastly, if you land three scatter symbols during this feature, the super bonus will be triggered. Next up is the regular bonus, which you can trigger by landing three or more scatter symbols, or it can be bought at a cost of 100 times the bet. During the bonus, bottomless chests are sticky throughout the feature, and treasure targets will be sticky until you get a cannonball to shoot at them. Lastly, the multiplier that you can get by shooting multiplier targets will be persistent throughout the bonus. The super bonus can either land from the third exciter buy as we talked about, or by buying it straight up at a cost of 500 times the bet. This works just like the regular bonus, but during this the cannons have unlimited ammo, so every target that lands will instantly be shot, meaning that you build the multiplier quicker and the hits are more frequent. Well, well, well. That about wraps it up for a fantastically well-made game from Elf. The Gold series has become one of the most prominent franchises in slots and Dead Man's Gold certainly does it justice. The new mechanics are interesting and fun as they should, but the core feature in the big symbols remains, making the game feel like an actual sequel and not a reskin or a brand new game. Thus we've given the game a rating of 8.5 out of 10 as it really feels like one of, if not the most, well-made game in the Gold series. Thanks a lot for watching another one of our reviews. The game is set to release at May 2nd, but we'll try to have a demo version of it on about slots earlier than that. 
There you can also read casino slot and provider reviews, participate in giveaways and claim exclusive casino bonuses. Remember, if you gamble, gamble responsibly. Until next time, peace!